Being able to use these uh, cover crops in ways that can benefit rural and urban communities is kind of a win-win for everybody. My name is Eric Miller. I'm the fourth generation farmer here, uh, the Miller family farm. Doing a lot of conservation practices um, with cash crops, being able to use cover crops to kind of manipulate how I can improve my bottom line. Everything I looked at kind of kept turning me towards cover crops. And the more I learned about them, the more I discovered how powerful they really are and how much they can help me. I can't wait to show farmers that this system works. I actually went to school for business and marketing. I really wanted to get into marketing. Um, I didn't even, I wasn't even FFA. I had no interest in farming. And then it just kind of dawned on me one day, you know, this is what I'm good at. I grew up doing it. And uh, there was nobody else in the family looking into taking over the family farm. And I felt like for me to step up and do it myself. So the main one I'm focusing on is I doubled the width of my corn and then I'm planting multiple species, mostly legumes that will fix nitrogen for my next year of corn. So I can move my corn rows back and forth, no-till, and then I'm also keeping a living root in that ground all year round. And I think that's, that's a huge, huge advantage. Now there are a lot of companies getting on board and, and teaching us how to use these cover crops properly. And, and the power of the internet it's been great to, you know, that's where I learned most of my information is YouTube videos and learning how to use this stuff on my own farm. Being able to do corn on corn no-till, especially in our hills that we have, you know, that's going to help Dubuque County with, with water quality. And it's going to help that farmer, they're able to get corn on corn, but also turn those cows out in that cover crop and graze it and get a lot of grazing days uh, instead of having to feed those cows in the fall. So that's going to be a huge advantage if you have cows. Cover crops have the ability with those living roots to keep the nutrients in place and even pull nutrients that have leached deep in the soil back to the surface to be able to use for your cash crops. And so it's kind of almost a side effect of improving the water quality to also improve your bottom line using cover crops. And obviously the community wants that and the farmers want better water quality. So it's, it's a good way for everyone to team up and, and work together. This is a good opportunity today, this field day, to show guys, you know, what the power of nature can do for you. So, it's exciting.